to demonstrate leaf loci to you using bread. My favorite animal is a hedgehog, so I'll use hedgehog traits to explain leaf loci. The three leaf loci we'll look at is eye color, pointiness of spikes, and ability to curl. Let's go have a look. Here's the map of the traits and the coefficient of coincidence. The first trait is eye color, which can be dominant for black or recessive for pink. The second is spikiness of the spikes, which can be spiky or soft. And then there's if the ability to curl, which they either can curl or cannot curl, the cannot curl is recessive. So we're gonna cross a pure breeding black eyed soft spike hedgehog with the ability to curl and a pure breeding pink eye sharp spike hedgehog that cannot curl. This will create a progeny that is heterozygous for each gene, and then we'll perform a test, a test cross of the F1 progeny. So let's see some crosses. <laughs> we see a double cross. A double cross is when there is a crossover between loci one and two, and then a crossover between loci two and three. The probability of that happening is shown, and the probability of a black eye, sharp spike, and can curl gamete and the probability of pink eyes with soft spikes and cannot curl gamete is 0 0.01275. We get this number by multiplying together the probability of a cross at the first locus, the probability of a cross at the second locus, and the coefficient of coincidence. Then we divide this number by two. These gamete gametes are both due to a double cross. Here we can see a single cross at position one. This occurs when there's a crossover event between loci one and loci two, like this. Here's the probability and it's shown. The probability of black eye sharp spikes that cannot curl gamete and the probability of pink eye with soft spikes that can curl gamete are both 0 0.06225. We get this number by subtracting the probability of a double cross from the probability of a cross at location one and then dividing this number by two. These gametes are both due to a single cross at location one. Here we can see a single cross at position two. This occurs when there's a crossover event between loci two and three, like this. The probability of that is shown. The probability of black eye with soft spikes that cannot curl gamete and the probability of pink eye with sharp spikes that can curl are both 0 0.08725. These gametes are both due to a single cross at location two. Finally, we can see the gametes when no crossover occurs. The probability of that happening is shown. The probability of black eyes with soft spikes and can curl gamete, and the probability of pink eyes with soft spikes and cannot curl gamete are both 0 0.33775. These gametes are both due to no cross. And now we get to eat some bread.